Happy holidays, everybody. Happy holidays. We're back in the bus, so I'm happy. And it's bloody cold. It's a bloody cold. It really is. And I'm hungry. Well, I've done your sandwiches and your crisps and your chocolate all ready for your journey. It's very nice of you, my little spring chicken, my little cupcake, my little pony granny. But we're going to get there lunchtime anyway, so. Yeah. Only going uh, locally, well, where is it? Evesham? Evesham? Cotswolds. Yeah, Cotswolds. Yeah, just, a couple of days, have a little break, you know. We have spent days looking, trying to find somewhere local. Turn left, then turn right. Um, a rame, there's just nothing on this time of year. Most, most sites are closed, aren't they? Yeah, yeah, yeah. A, lot of, a lot of sites are closed. They don't reopen until... Turn right, uh, then turn oh, left. Bloody sat now. Don't open uh, until March or even April, so we are struggling. Yeah. But of course, we had to come away. We've got to come away. This is what we do. So yeah, so uh, yeah, we'll uh, oh, crack on. What's the site called? Morton in Marsh. Morton in Marsh. What's the site called? Morton in Marsh. Club site. How is it? Right, bloody hell, it's going to be one of them days again, people. That's nothing new there, is it? <laughs> you can't whack it. I will whack it. No, we're stuck in traffic. Are you cold? Froze. You wrapped up like a glisky mo. It's freezing. You are looking really pretty today though. Shut up, Chris. <laughs> the bloody hell, it's foggy out there, people. It is. Don't Ooh. see much scenery, are we? No. You can't mm. whack the Cotswolds, man. You can't whack it. I love being the bus. Love it. He hasn't shut up all week, well, since we got back. Which is over a week now. No, no, we're not doing misses. We got back last Friday. Did we? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, yeah, a week. We're not doing misses. This way of life is amazing. I wish I could live in my van. <sighs> no. I know I ramble on about it, but you can't whack it. You just ramble on. I bet lots of you think the same, don't you? Live in your van. You don't need bricks and mortar. I do like a base. No, you've got a base in here. No, I can't bring it. You're some wheels. But I can't bring everything with me. You can bring me, that's all you need. Oh, enough said, eh? Enough said. And while I think about it, can I just let you all know, keep you informed, keep you up to date. Our meetup, we're just waiting for the paperwork now, but it's looking good. For June. Yeah, June 24th. June the 24th. That weekend. Yeah. And it'll be a celebrating, celebratory weekend. Oh yeah? On the 26th, is it? Oh yeah. Slow down, Rob. Unbelievable. <laughs> Keep your bloody hell. Bloody hell! Turn around now, so they can see us there. I'm going to back of a bus. Like. That's very true. Yeah. What do we do? Stop in the bus or what? two in front of us, so I really don't know. No, well, what do I do? Just wait, Robert. Have a bit of patience. I've got no patience. No, I know that. I really thought this site was a lot further away from Morton in Marsh Centre than it is, and it's just up the road. You jump on the scooters, off we go. No, you walk. The back end now, the scooters, you can't walk. No, we've got to do some walking. What? Diet starts Monday. Yeah, right. I don't know what to do here. Well, I don't know. Really. I say there, fish and chip van here on Saturday 6 till 7.30. There you go, it's fish and chips for tea tomorrow. It's sorted. Unbelievable. Right, so we'll go and... Uh, we'll go out, go and bang them some money. I might get a service pitch actually so I can wash the van down. 
does. He's absolutely fit. You haven't cleaned his ever since we got back from Scotland. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. Right, we're here, people. Yeah. We're all set up, finally. Oh, Took about a bloody hour to park up. Just a mission. They're doing a lot of building work on it, apparently, and they've sh closed off the side. And then they've so had to we reopen were, it. Yeah, so we were driving about right, right knobs. Yeah, so they've had to reopen it. They shut one shower block, and now they've had to reopen it because they've overbooked, and it's just an absolute farce. But oh, we're done. We're done. We're all happy. That and it's a beautiful day. It's bloody cold. <laughs> we're parked up there on a, uh, what is it, a white peg? Yeah. I didn't know that the white peg and the blue peg are the same price. Yeah. I just put a blue peg because I knew we weren't having an awning, but there were no blue pegs, so we had to have a white peg. Just, just and we know. need to go and tell them which picture are. So what, why are blue and white pegs? Um, I don't know. Once, because they're narrow, you don't... Yeah, but this pitch is... Uh, yeah, because it's time, it's got massive awning and a car. Yeah. Bus is filthy, but there's nothing I can do about it. You could wash it. Oh, hey, got no water. Right, let's Excuses. crack on. Go and tell them what picture you're on. 26. Yeah, so this site is all about location again, people. It's perfect to walk into Morton on the Marsh. Morton in Marsh. Morton in Marsh. We had this argument last time we came. Did we? Yeah. Right, we're, we're here anyway. We're in Morton. We're in Morton in Marsh. Mo is it Morton in Marsh? Yes. Or? Bloody hell. So, yeah. You were right off a uh, main road there, barrier. Yeah, it's very, very busy side. Because most sides should. Yeah, we've been really, I did say earlier, but we've been really struggling. Yeah, but most sites aren't open until March or even April. Mm. So. so we're lucky to find somewhere. Yes. Happy days, happy holidays. So you've got some, a yurt, well, a couple of yurts, a couple of, uh, what are they, tents or something? Safari tents. Safari tents. Uh, kiddie play area. And my little angel. A cold angel. You cold? Coldies. Just trying to find the dog walk, to take the dogs a walk. Oh, well, there it is, I would say, because there's a poo bins and... Yeah. And over there, they've got some little, I don't know what they are, to be honest. I suppose you can vent them out little like, I don't know, what's the, what you call them? Hot. Yeah, some of them. Yeah, so you've got uh, a little dog walking area here, which is pretty adequate to be out, I suppose. Do you think it's pretty adequate? I do, and then you can let them off, which is good. Yeah. So we're happy with that. Yeah, those, I don't know what they're called. I can't think of what they're called. Like little holiday lit. It looks like a shed. Looks like a shed, yeah, but it's not a bloody shed. They look like a shed with windows in. Yeah. Happy with that, though. <laughs> we just realised what they're called, glamping pods. I didn't realise it, I've just read it. Oh. There's a big sign on that gate. We're a bit slow today, people. He is. Unbelievable. Yeah, it says, please respect the privacy of our guests staying in these glamping pods. They don't look like glamping pods to me. They look like sheds. Oh, and there's somebody staying in one. Yeah, so keep the noise down about the sheds. Yeah. <laughs> what are you laughing at? I was just thinking, I wonder if that's where they hold the AA meetings. All in a little city, a little circle. <laughs> Hello, my name is Lynn and I'm an alcoholic. Unbelievable. You're in a funny little mood today, aren't you? I don't know. I don't know, it's a gay. Um, that way goes to the town, that way goes to Batsford Arboretum. Don't know, sheep in the field. I was only joking by the way, I'm not really an alcoholic. You like a drink though, don't you? We all like a drink, don't we? Everybody likes it. When you're on holiday, you've got to have a drink. I'm always on holiday then. Yeah, it is a... Uh... There are a few people here in these glamping pods. Yeah, yeah, I don't know how much they are, do you? They must be heated, because they, they don't look heated. No, I'm going to have a look though. Right, let's have a look. Yes, they are heated and they've got a lovely seating area. I have. Deck, uh, yeah, decking. Uh, you've got a barbecue point here. I don't know how much they are though. I'm going to have a look. We're going to find out, are we? I am. And they are heated, aren't they? Yes. Yes, they are. And they provide the table and chairs as well, which is pretty good. And it's lit. Yeah. Are they lightened in here? Yeah, yeah, they've got a light there, yeah. yeah. Happy, happy with that, are you? 
cool, let's crack on. Yes, and uh, you've got your parking area for the... Uh, half pod, aesthetics. For the half aesthetics, <laughs> yeah. Yeah, yeah, because I've all got names. What's that one called? Reinick. Oozle. Winchat. Yeah, they've all got names anyway. Yeah, it's okay, that is. I bet they're bloody expensive, I know that. What do you think? Probably. The best Marjorie in the world. And then in the next field, you've got the yurts. Raised off the ground, which is good. Decking area. Not going to go in, there might be somebody in there. There isn't. Yeah, but I'm not going in anyway, but... Yeah, I do like the look of the safari tents. Yeah, let's go and have a look at the safari tent. Bloody workmen everywhere as well. And yeah, you've got the safari tents here, which are pretty spectacular, to be honest. I really do like those. Oh, you like those, do you? I do. Yeah, you've got your own, they supply the own, your own benches and chairs and tables. Yeah, and a big kitchen area inside. Picnic table there. What? Big kitchen area inside. And I don't think you'd be able to see. I don't think we should be here, to be honest. We'll, we'll have a look. Yeah, I don't think you'd be able to see in there, but you've got a microwave, a sink, a bed. What else you got? We just had a look. Yeah, lovely. What? I just showed you. Can I help? Not really. <laughs> yeah, so you got two of these. One, two, two yurts. Your own private little area. It's very pretty. It's really pretty. It's and that's a fantastic idea. The barbecue things outside each one. Yeah. Yeah, I'm happy about that, are you? Yeah. Let's crack on. What's the matter with you? Oh, you froze. Bloody hell. Yes, this place is absolutely rammed. Isn't it? Yeah. I'm happy with that. Facility block. This is the men's, obviously. <laughs> uh, very warm, I must say. Uh, looks like it wants a bit of updating. But I think, I think they're, they're fixing the... Because there's two blocks on the site. One is shut and I think they're doing all that out. And then shutting this one and then opening the other one obviously and doing this one up I think I think that's the plan anyway yes it's quite a big site isn't it yes it is there you go yes and tomorrow we'll go into Morton on Marsh into the town which is only just around the corner yes and tonight Hang on. And tonight, we'll have our slog. No. You can have a <laughs> glass of gin and tonic and a hot dog. I like a hot dog, do you? That's what you're having. Can't wacky people. So, I've had a look and I've found out how much these are. The sheds. They're not sheds, they're pods. Okay, glamping pods. They're advertised from £59 a night. I don't know when that is, because if you want to book the weekend, this weekend, tonight, well, Saturday and Sunday, it's £198 for two nights. So £200, pound, people? Yeah, in the week, it's £138 for a midweek break for two nights. So Is that expensive? Well, I'll leave that up to you. Well, I think it is. Well, you would. Yeah. Why? It don't matter to you, does it? You don't pay for nothing. Shut up, Robert. I just think it is. <laughs> but I suppose if you're not fortunate like us to have a motorhome or a caravan, then yeah, I suppose that's I've got you, haven't they? I've always got you somewhere, haven't yeah. they? So we're going to leave it there for today, and we'll be back. We're going to have a walk around Morton in Marsh on our next video. So join us then. Have a kiss, sir. No. I've had a right cocking day. I have. You have, haven't you? I've glued my bloody best trousers. Got, got super glue all over them. What else have I done? I'm walking about with a dog lead round my neck and I haven't got the bloody no. dogs with me. We've put the dogs away and he's still round out with his dog lead. It's just one of them things going wrong for me again. Oh well, never mind. Come yeah. on, wrap it up. What? 
Yeah, so stay safe at a caravan as motor owners, tenders, drifters, subscribers, old and new. We still love you. We do. And if you come across this channel, please give us a like and subscribe if you haven't and drop us a comment. Hope you're having a great weekend, people. We'll see you soon. See you Very soon. Yeah, in a bit. <laughs>